Welcome to the channel, everybody. We are outside. The birds are chirping. The wildlife is roaring. And we're fixing to get ready and have a big day and get her done. First thing on the list, I'm going to tackle this jungle right here. I bet you there's creatures in there for sure. Yeah. Looks like my cover came down on my electrical box. So, uh, this is a job for the big beast of a weed eater. So, I'm going to go get it. First thing I got to do is mix some fuel. Um, pull it completely out of two-stroke gas. So, I got to mix that up. And this shouldn't take me more than a few minutes. And we can get on with the rest of the stuff. Get that fence cut out of there. We're going to make some progress today. All right. Different strokes, it takes different strokes, it takes different strokes to do the work. What you talking about, Willis? Waldo. Oh. San Francisco Be sure to wear flowers in your fur Enough of the silliness start pulling some fence getting to work on some stuff here we go all right now that all that weeds are gone you're like take down the fence dog man nope we're moving on we're gonna focus on finishing this side then and only then i'm gonna take down the fence and get in there and start on the front but for now let's not leave this side unfinished and move on to a new one. No, we're going to finish it. Putting the trim on, getting it all purty fied. Going to have to drag out the table saw, possibly the chop saw. I don't know, let's get it done. I saw him standing there by the knuckle bone machine. 
Bonaco knew he must have been a silly thing. And then I took him home and gave him a milk bone. You don't like my singing today? He don't. Alright guys, I can't work in this environment right here. You gotta get all these dingleberries, these foam dingleberries, raked up and get them out of the way. You! Again! Man! You! You just stay out of my way, okay? And yeah, we're gonna have a talk. Me and you. I, I can't take you no more. I'm gonna paint you. Do something. Uh. Another pile to break up and <laughs> that is what is left of Big Bird. Big Bird was the favorite toy of Lucy who died five years ago. She loved that. I had to keep buying these things because she'd destroy them. Yep. That was something to see. Crap up on the here out of my way. I'm wrong with it. at a later date. I will let you guys know. I'll put it down in the description the next time I'm going to rake this up. Alright guys. Here's the problem I'm gonna running into here. I want to run a piece of trim all the way down to the bottom. But the problem I'm having, you see, is this is in the way. I have to take a half an inch off of this dude in order for that to fit. So what we're going to try to do here, I've been telling you guys about these tools, some of you got them, this multi-tool. I'm going to take a half an inch off of this board. I mean, it's a lot easier than putting some kind of saw up here. You, you couldn't get one on it. So let's see how this works. Put my glasses on. I'm going to start out by just scoring the line. And I got a screw here that I can't get. It's too deep. We'll chip the wood away from around it. time consuming. That's gonna go like that. <laughs> All 
All right, guys, about 10 minutes later, and it wasn't that bad. It's just like a chisel. You know, I got it where I can now get this up in here. Of course, I'll be angling it with the roof and get a nice tight fit in there. Uh, but that little tool is pretty handy. You know, pretty decent cut on that thing. This is what they are. Uh, if you guys want to get one, uh, go on my, in the description on my Amazon page, and I've got this listed. Uh, check it out, man. They're handy for a lot of stuff. All right, let's get back to work. All right, we're going to put the last piece on. It's been a lot of work to get to this point. What do you want to say? Ooh. the drill. No, you didn't. Don't bring me down, Bruce. Don't bring me down, Bruce. Don't bring me down. Well, told you to stay, you stay. Peace. move this ladder we'll get a gander at it there we have it guys I mean it ain't perfect but I think I can just get some paint up in there where that spot's showing and uh, you're not gonna notice uh, some of these boards were warped a little bit and, uh, oh hang on I've been on hold oh uh, yes sir yeah, yeah, yeah. I got your email about my my uncle dying over there in Somalia, and he was a billionaire. Something about an inheritance. Say again. I, I can't understand you, man. Huh? You, you got somebody there that speaks English? No, that's not English. How is it you can type perfect English? Then I call to get you on the phone. I can't understand a word you're saying. And I want my money. And uh, I didn't even know I had an uncle in Somalia, but I'm glad I did because I, I need some more money for my project, man. Yeah. Okay, you're going to... Hello? Yeah, no. I, I need somebody who speaks English. English. No, habla. Hung up on me. Man. How am I going to get that money? <sighs> All right. Let's get back to work, guys. Well, you, you can't lay there, baby girl. I got to work right here, okay? Yeah, we're going to take this piece of fence out. Oh, you going to help, too? They, they said they wanted to help, but, you know time comes they're out there all right guys I gotta get your light your night lights out yeah. we'll hang them right here when this is all painted you'll have two lanterns they're gonna look like daddy's dog house even nicer all right well these birds sure are loud today Oh, they, might, it's, they think it's probably about that time where I start feeding them. I ain't going to feed them yet. Now these things, 
I don't know if y'all can see. Here in about a week, these will open up. And they got little spikes in them. I don't know what these are. And boy, you touch them, they just stick to your clothes. You're picking them out forever. So getting, getting rid of this is going to help get rid of them things. Don't like them. It ain't going to be fun getting your fence up with that weeds there. Let me back y'all up a little bit. Y'all just yeah, you can't get up in my nostrils like that, man. Okay. Oh, that was a ball. I'm in the yard of many toys. I want to make sure I'm cutting the right one. Yeah, see that ain't. Well. <coughs> Darn sure, get all this wire out of here. I don't want the dogs stepping on it. Alright, got this dude in there. Ah, okay, I'm gonna lay around that. When I put the new fence on, I went around the old fence. I know this is your favorite spot to sleep, but it's going bye-bye. Oh, that was easy. And then uh, all along this fence I've got pieces of two-foot rebar. Keep the dogs from... They used to have a lot more dogs in this yard. Some of them were diggers. These two, they don't want to get out. They got it made. I think I'm just going to resort to brute force here. Brute force. Oh, putting it in while I was putting it out. Alright guys, I'm going to come back when I'm done here. Because this is boring stuff, man. Right. I'm about getting worn out. Alright guys. I'm going to pull this T-post using the cheap man method. The man don't want to go out and spend money on a T-post puller. You just use the T-post driver. See? Bend it back. Get it in the tooth. <laughs> ah, ah, like such. See there? I'm almost out of there. Catch. <clears throat> Simple as that. Alright. Now well, all I have to do is get rid of these weeds.
very impressive. Who is weed trimmer? Yep. Never had a battery powered one. Alright guys, that's about all. Let me get where I can see you. Whew. I'm wore out, man. That's about all I'm gonna do today. We've actually been out here several hours. Uh, that trim takes a while, especially when you gotta make little special cuts and that. But uh, we're gonna get this painted tomorrow. Looks like it's clouding up to rain though, so we'll see what happens. But I still need to frame out around the dog uh and you see need to frame out around the dog uh, entrance put a new uh permanent i'm just going to use a mud flat or a uh, floor mat from a vehicle they work good i'm going to put this fascia board on and uh get all this buttoned up <laughs> let me show you what happened here what happened here is i built this wall inside there this is the last wall to go up but when I raised it, I forgot to overhang the T111 to cover this sidewalls, the 2x4. So now i got to fit a piece in there. Uh, I don't know. We'll get it all done. <laughs> but when you don't do stuff like that every day, that's what happens. So anyway, i got, I got more screws to get put in here, get it painted, get the trim on, and then move on to the other side. We got this piece of fence to take out. We'll take it out in the morning. Uh, I also got to relocate. Let me get you over here. I also got to relocate plumbing. I have uh, bought two two spigots to go into the, one in the building there and one here, so I get the dogs water. So that's already out of the ground. I just have to wait till I do the plumbing, and uh, we'll get these guys all fixed up. I already like that a lot better. Yeah. All right, man, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, subscribe, give me a like, give me an unlike. I don't care. And uh, did y'all notice anything unusual in today's video? If so, put it down in the comments. I'd like to know who who figures it out first. Huh? You know me, man. I like messing with you. Happy trails.